Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Omohun Jaroge, a travel and lifestyle blogger based in Nairobi, Kenya. And happy, happy new year, guys. How is your 2021 20, coming so far? My 2021... <laughs> my 2021 is amazing. Uh, I can't complain. So far, so good. Uh, we're hoping for big things. We are hoping we're going to achieve... Uh, the dreams, the vision boards. The 2021 is about to be one great year. And uh, I can't wait for it. In this video, we're going. I'm going to be showing you guys, if you live in a bed sitter, how you can arrange and organize your small bed sitter. For those who don't know what a bed sitter is, it's a studio apartment. That means a one-roomed house that has that is self-contained that has a kitchen bathroom and toilet yeah so it's just a small room and arranging arranging a bed sit at times can be tiresome especially if you have uh, a lot of things and uh, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to organize your bed sitter uh, I also want to thank you to thank everyone who subscribed to this channel from my bed sitter house to a video that video is doing so well it's the video that has given me the most subscribers and I really appreciate all of you um, it has so many views that I was not even ready for and um, I hope this follow-up video is going to help you who came from that video or who will come to this video through this video uh, organize your house a little bit so yeah let's get straight into so it guys, uh, I'm about to show you my space from a distance and <sighs> this is what you see when you get in so this is the bathroom and toilet and we'll let, let us just start from here so in this room i got that bathroom organizer to help me organize my cleaning stuff showering stuff everything cleaning and then i put my tissues over there that's the toilet and this is the bathroom that's the sink and that's where i put my dirty laundry yeah what I like about this house is that the, the, the bathroom itself is organized, as you have seen. So, yeah, and then uh, the arrangement is really primarily depends on how the house has been built. And for this house, I think they had set up everything just perfectly. So organizing it for me was not hard at all because uh, the only thing that... I changed a little bit is that the TV aerial okay let me show you so from the bathroom you get into the room now this is what we call a bed sitter everything is in one room as you can see the bed the entertainment area and the kitchen so what i like about this house is everything is organized because the way the way it had been set up is definitely the kitchen will be on this side i don't like uh crowded spaces and since the house is small i never got the dish rack where maybe when you wash utensils because i like my spaces clean like this even yeah i like my spaces clean so uh, every time after after i wash my my dishes i just wipe them and put them into those spaces over there i don't have many utensils and this is where i put my shopping and these other spaces are for more utensils i chose this to be a kitchen area uh be you can either put the fridge or the kitchen but on this side there are no sockets 
that's why the kitchen is here and I don't have the cooker and the fridge is on this side that's where I put my food stuff my cadast bin uh, my kitchen was was on was over where the fridge was and uh, it was quite distracting at times so that's why the fridge came to that side and the TV came to this side I also preferred to mount my TV I also preferred to mount my my TV because uh, it gives me more space on the TV stand to place those the, there is the my decorations and if you've not watched my video where I set up the flowers I did the DIY project I'll link the video up so you can go check it out and see how I did uh, so this is my TV area as I said I like my spaces clean and empty as you can see then when you come to this other side there is the bed there is the bed what I wish there is the bed and the closet yeah this is the bed and the closet the only disadvantage is that this house is so small but at least the owner had foreseen that because my bed is a five by five bed and it fits it fits perfectly and the the thing that he did and i really commend the guy about it for the closet he didn't put a a door because the door could have been so bulky and the bed it have it will have forced me to have a different arrangement for the bed and the house will not have looked very good and that leaves me with a space for my study table yeah that's where i put my study table and my mirror although for this space over here if I didn't have this type of table, it's enough to fit in a two-seater couch. But for me, I didn't see the need for having a two-seater couch. Well, I need a study table and my bed is right here. You get what I'm saying? So, basically, my house is arranged in an... This... Ad, it's more of a U. Yeah, it's it's more of a U shaped kind of thing. And I have this whole space. This whole let me climb on top of here. I have this whole space that is empty. And that that makes my house to be less crowded. So guys, if you're looking maybe to arrange your house, let me just put in some clips of exactly, some murals of how exactly it's arranged and maybe you could uh, get an idea of, or two. Many of you will wonder, many of you will wonder why my <laughs> dispenser is on the cooker. It got spoiled, it got spoiled. And I thought this is the perfect place to put this and because I don't use this. I use the the kameko. That is what I used to cook. And in the east, yeah. So I decided to just place, I decided to just place the water dispenser. It doesn't have, it's just it's more of a dummy dispenser i decided to just place it over over there for storage spaces where i store my suitcases my my things that but basically it's just suitcases i put them under the bed and there's just one carton over there there's one carton over there and there are more things apochini especially for the clothes for the for the duvets extra duvets extra uh extra what is it called my bags 
everything because honestly i don't like things lying around that's why everything now everything that i don't want to be seen or is not in use i hide it there there or 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 under the bed in my suitcases so basically that's my simple arrangement for the house let me just take some b-rolls and show you guys so that you can have a clear a clear picture of how this house looks like and maybe if you need to steal some ideas feel free to do it and uh, if you liked this video make sure you give it a thumbs up leave me a comment in the comment section down below leave me a comment let's engage uh, also maybe you can share your, your your photos on how you've arranged your houses yeah we help each other in arranging our spaces so oh and on this space i didn't show you this wall this wall i put a bit a wallpaper i put it in my first house tour yeah that's my table small bedside table then study table stool yawageni kitchen on this side that's why i put my shoes also the reason why my shoes are lying around as they are is because i feel like if i put in a shoe rack in this house it will be too crowded especially in the entryway so that's why i don't have a shoe rack and i decided to just put them the way they are over there because i don't it will be so crowded anyway uh yeah that's it for my house <laughs> So let me just shoot b-rolls and show you how exactly so you can get a clear picture of how the house is. I'm so crazy about you. I'm so crazy about you. Babe, we can count all the stars in the sky as they pass by your face. Trip up to Mars, hold you tight in my arms all the way First time out of space Well, baby, I would give you the galaxies Fall for your love when there's no gravity, gravity Hop on this rocket ship, I got a blast Girl, you're so confident subscribe to this channel share the video and see you in the next one remember i post videos every tuesday 9 a.m and a bonus video on thursdays though not on thursdays but i'll try and post more thursdays but the main video is on tuesday so see you in the next one bye